Hello? Wait, can you hear me? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> That's so funny! <laughs> let's go, let's finish this off right! Real now, I won't miss any quick times because I don't want the text. What do I do now? Like, everyone's dead. <laughs> Who am I gonna play as? To find the wolf. Wait, no, we found him and he killed us. Never mind, never mind, never mind. <laughs> oh my god, wait, Nick is so alive. Everyone didn't die. <gasps> Emma's alive. Not everyone died. Okay, Brenda Song shouldn't have died. That. Okay, Caleb. Haha. -ha. That was too good. Yeah. Yeah. Pile up. Oh, I'm definitely replaying. What do you make of that? What do I make of that? Why are they putting the bodies in a pile? They should respectfully bury them, or... Well, you know, at one point, the way to respectfully uh, bury people was to put them in a pile and set it on fire, called a pyre. What does pyre mean, if not a pile fire? Anyways, I'm pretty sure that the pile they reference is metaphorical. And I'm, I'm pretty sure. I really hope it is. Yeah, that would be shoddy detective work. I thought we'd done the whole Hackett's Quarry thing. Not this Hackett's Quarry thing. What was this, like three months ago? Old news, dude. Anton, introductions first. We are Bizarre Yet Bonafide, the podcast of the paranormal. I'm Grace. And I'm Anton. And together, we explore the possibility of supernatural involvement in real-life, everyday occurrences. And that's exactly what they are. Real-life, everyday occurrences. With a shadow of spiritual, supernatural occurrences. Who else is watching that isn't Andrea? Okay, so I hope you've got hat insurance, Anton, because I'm about to blow your mind. Did you just ask? I know who it is. I know they're laughing. It's responsible to ensure. Well, you know what? Which I had the last laugh because I let okay, I everyone get killed at the end. So, anyway, they're actually that's just me though. The real reason that we're coming back to Hackett's Quarry. There have been some developments, and I've sourced some information. I remain skeptical, but I'm all ears. Under my hat. I was hoping you'd say that. Oh God, why? Why are you smiling? Stop it, I hate it. Why? I have braces. I have to make use of them sometimes. You do have very pretty teeth. Thank you. That's so were they trying to indicate like a DLC or like a so, sequel? It just so happens I've got someone on the inside. So today's episode is going to have a bit of oh. a show and tell. Whoever that other person was left. Who do you know on the inside? The inside of where? 
What? You know someone on the inside? Don't we all have someone on the inside? You know, an inner critic that says, stop doing a podcast, no one's listening. You should listen to that voice, Grace. Okay, well, what I really meant is, let's call it an anonymous donation. You know, we're not the only ones who... Justice Smith's name right next to Brenda's song, I know that's right. Someone actually reached out to us. They sent us a package. Did you, you didn't open it. Anyone who, I don't trust anyone who listens to this show. Oh, I couldn't wait to open it. Surprise! Anonymous donation. Okay, you've always promised me since the day <laughs> did. Podcast, okay. If you could see okay. true evidence, you will consider all options, right? One of them was intentional, I mean, I and it was so then they could meet together in the afterlife. Okay, well... The other one wasn't my fault. She should have just listened. Okay, fine. Maybe if she was a true Filipino. We are about to open a package from a mysterious yeah. person who listens to this show. If you are the one who sent us whatever it is, congrats, you got us. Sorry, the tape is just really, really. It's oh my god, so what'd they get? Package. Sorry, can you help me with this? Do you have like a key I could like? Slice at it with? No, I don't want you to dull my key. Just use your fingers. But just give me your fucking key, Anton. No. Give me your fucking key. No. Get your own key. Not like you lock your door. Of course I lock my door. What are you? What are you hiding? What am I hiding? Do you not lock your doors? No, I'm Andrea, not. I feel like we should be hired to write for the second game. No, ghosts or the next game, whatever it is. Walk through my walls, Anton. Okay, you need to be more eat. concerned with murderers. Take a look. Apparently, they found another body. Whoa! You can't just show me a picture of a dead body. You got to tell me before you're going to do that. Okay, then let's take this over. Anton, can I show you a picture of a dead body? No! I can't work with that, Anton. Okay, fine. What is yes. going on? It's, it's a dead body. Okay, what, what <gasps> Diana would be perfect for this game. That went missing. Do you remember that? Yes. Oh, that's the it'd be too. Whoa. Story. We need to fan cast yeah. the next game for this. Was drowned in the lake. Okay, drowned. Who do I want to see in this? Gender. Gender Ortega. First person cast. Swimming and you drowned. If some, if he's been drowned, then someone drowned. It's basically X. So. Then I think I implied precisely what I meant to imply. Now, of course, I can't verify this info. Of course you can't. What? Do I have like a history of not verifying? Yes, it's fake. Okay, but I feel very strongly that he was drowned. Okay, well, do the police know about this? Are the Hackett family suspects? Okay, okay, I like that you are getting into this. dialogue is going on too long. The newspaper says this guy's still missing, right? He looks pretty fucking found in this picture. Okay, yeah, I mean, he's not missing. He's are right they talking there, about the lost? Why? Why would they say lost he's still hikers? missing? Because it is a conspiracy, a cover up. Don't you see? They're all in on it. I, I, who is all in on it? The Hackett family? The Hackett family, the North Kill Gazette. I told you I've been suspicious of them from the start. Okay, uh, okay, so there's the one hiker, he's dead. What about the other one? Ann Radcliffe? I can't Still tell. Missing. It's not letting me zoom in or anything. I don't know, this is pretty inconclusive. I, I'm sorry that the guy drowned, but this kind of seems like a big to-do over nothing. Or is it a big undo of something, which is what a cover-up is? Okay, you can't just twist my words like that. Okay, so I anticipated your skepticism, which is why I saved this little gem for now. Finally, you're going to present me with some ghost ectoplasm. Put out your ring finger. I've got a little gem to slide onto it. What do you got? Leaked photos from the hiker's camera. Photos that oh, show they're them. going through the evidence. Quarry. So maybe they okay. were there and then they dropped their camera. It happens all the time. Got yeah, it. They dropped their camera whilst being murdered. And their bags were found there too. Oh, no way. Do you have a fake photo of them too? Oh, please. Okay. So you have a picture of bags. Honestly, the writing bags. in this made the no, game like so much funner to play. Their photos from their camera, like it's so. And they have a monogram of their initials. It was like think, so bad least, that it was like good and it was camp. Can't tell. Yeah. Okay. That's not nothing. Summer camp. So we've got to talk a little more about the Hackett family. Right. So these guys are like the heritage landowners, right? Mm-hmm. 
Yep. Their great 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 grandparents were trappers who claimed the land way back when. They just claimed it? Yes, they did. They put their flag on it just like the I would so watch this as a movie. The Hackett family flag. Except they need to do something about those werewolves. Those were not werewolves. They found quartzite. Quartzite? Okay. They literally could have said it was like anything. Or they could have made them furry. Like what is that? New York is made of Wartzite. That's not fun or a fact. Most of them are. But I digest. Digress? It was a pun. They dug the quarry and hit great heights of success before Septimus Hackett, classic bad guy name, the seventh okay, I'm like barely son of the trappers, to this. The Can they pick up the pace? Great supernatural powers uh -huh. closed the mine down okay so then they only had the land to live off they're making me wish i found this land actually moonlight i had a good day that's a lot of forest <laughs> oh that was the perfect way to open this game wow okay a great place to hide to have all these dark secrets i totally forgot about that wow and this that is was where amazing. A little more into paranormal territory. Okay, here acres we go. Acres and acres of haunted woods. If you say so. Wow. Welcome to Bizarre Yet Bonafide, the podcast of the paranormal. Welcome back to Bizarre Yet Bonafide. Anton, Another episode. today I'm actually going to pass you some light writing. Okay, you're going to make me read this? Mm-hmm. All right, um, this is... What you're seeing now is a copy of a letter that Kaylee Hackett wrote to her grandma. God, that made me wish I found no... Evidence. <sighs> All right. Uh, this seems like more of a you job, but I suppose right, I can Right, but I, read I this. feel like if some of the evidence comes from your mouth, it will have more clout. Right. Okay. Here we go. Gammy, how long are we gonna drag this shit out? I know family is the most. Oh, he's a really thing. good reader. I want to know what's outside the forest, outside this damn house and camp, and I sure <laughs> what as hell you found nothing. About no credit. Happen because of who we are. <laughs> Maybe we can explain what's going on. Fucking show people. Then they'll know we got no control over it. I know you just try yeah, to Yeah, for real. Like, can they speed it up? Can I watch this at two times no speed? And right now it feels like we stuck in a dark hole. I can't sleep, Gammy. Or if I do, I dream about that fucking fire. We were just dumbass kids back then. I wish it never happened. Love, K, X, O, X, O. That took a turn. Yes. Dream about that fucking fire. Does that not read as the haunted... Well, that was crazy for real. Saw something that they shouldn't have seen. Yeah, no, I'm fully creeped out. She okay, this stuff. time this when I play... I mean... Uh, let me try and keep everyone alive. Again, I can't verify any of this. So I won't. I won't do no stupid choices. Man, this poor girl. Yeah, there was something going. I was just trying to have a little fun, you know, make it a little interesting. I'm gonna have to say it really went downhill when they tried to make me unlock the gate to let Jacob out. That. They set me up for that one. They set me up. Because there were no instructions. I was just flipping levers, hoping for the best. That was like messed up. by Travis Hackett. We're not doing anything illegal. Aren't we? Think about it. I guess it wasn't technically sent to us. Season to assist letters. No, I want to play Until Dawn again. Hmm. Okay. That can be too good. Next, we have this empty vial. Thing. Now, to me, empty implies that it was Yeah, full. see, I Same saw the thing. cell numbers What's after, things, and I was what? like, that well, Freaky. that's Some too late, because I already let Do the I other guy out. Well, <laughs> I was like, like, okay, <laughs> well, guys know who he's we are. dying. Okay, Anton, what you see next pretty much confirms it. They are a crackpot conspiracy theorist, a loser? Shit went down at Hackett's Quarry this summer. 
real. Wait, why is this? Why does this podcast have all the evidence and not the police? Always overselling it. You always have to. How did they even get the evidence if everyone died? All right. Okay, this is actual footage from one of the trail cams in Hackett Woods. Oh, cool! A camera in the middle of the woods. Did they find a squirrel? Be honest. If it was mounted on a mountain bike, you would watch that whole video. Yes, of course. Is there a mountain bike involved? No, but take a look, anyways. Okay, that is a bear. That is a bear too. Can I like look around or something? Like, okay. why do I what? A skinny bear. Okay, this could be some of the clearest footage of something like this I've ever seen. Right, it's kind of blurry though. Blurry and convincing. Sometimes the truth can't be contained blah, blah, blah. in the lines. Right, yeah. And also, footage is pretty easy to fake. Technology is super scary. I don't like this what man. What the were the Hackett's doing with footage like this anyways? Huh. Yeah, that's a good point. Weird little video of a skinny bear. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe Again, just believe women. A skinny bear. Have you seen a skinny bear? Yes, this is very sad. Research. Oh. Yeah, polar bears. It's hard for them to find food sometimes. Don't feel too bad for them, though. They're nasty. Okay, but putting the Hackett family aside for a moment, there's more to this. Are you ready for some real spooky shit? I'm ready for real spooky right? shit. Right? Like, why is he shutting down everything this girl's saying? Don't get too freaked out. I'll try my hardest. Okay, do you want to hold my hand? No. It's okay. because he's a sissy. Do to comfortingly pat your back? Please, just say what you're going to say. Do you want me to turn all the lights on so you don't... I don't want you to do anything. I want you to say what you have. Okay, so what's this? What are we looking at now? Podcast people are like the most annoying people on this earth. Emma Mountbank downloaded from her phone. Oh my god, is this real? Well, <laughs> Sissy Papa? That is what we're here to discuss. <laughs> okay, this looks I like shocked. Sissy Papa. <laughs> I mean, doesn't it? Okay, but if you downloaded photos from my phone, yes, they would all be shocked. Where's well. the picture be Emma took to make my eyes of the werewolf up close and personal? Any of those filters. That was, that was high camp. She should have been screaming, yeah, running away. Weird. She whipped that phone out, weird. took a picture with Flash, yeah. then kept running. The hell happened? More than we Not many people could do that. Yeah. There's something else, too. Okay. <sighs> Look at what happens when I put it through a negative filter. Whoa! Whoa. Okay, what is that? Okay, why can't I see it? The hag of Hackett's quarry. The hag. Full circle. Uh, no, 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 no. That could be anything. Like what? Okay, now I feel like they're like repeating these um credits. There can't be that many people. There's people. There's Jesus shows up on toast every once in a while. This could be whatever. Well, I don't need to hear too much more about your breakfast, but I can't believe that you're still questioning this. You're doubting your own cynicism now, though. I can tell. I can smell the doubt that you usually apply to other things on yourself. Picks or didn't happen, right? Well, picks. God, how many pieces of evidence did I find? You can fabricate experiences. You can't. I need to, I, I would need to see the Hag of Hackett's quarry myself. Well, if you want to go to North Kill with me, no, I actually have a really I don't. good okay. relationship. I believe you. Okay, but you know what? I have something that couldn't be fabricated. Oh my god. Claw marks in a wall. I, I could make this Ooh, okay, right I remember now. finding just that one. Find me a wall, I'll take a fork and just go to town. I think we're, we're almost at the end. Thanks. Well, to me, this isn't actually overtly supernatural because it could have just been, you know, an animal or someone's angry parrot. But it'd be unfair not to discuss. I wonder Why? if because the audience has come that to boy, respect a certain the gay boy, of the I don't remember his name. Sometimes do a little bit of if he yeah, cannot lose his arm, well, like if he can did keep out, his arm. Thought it was worth sharing. I assume there is. This is all just a prank, you know. It was just a prank, Anton! Who even are you? It's probably just some teenager who's making fun of you. It's probably that dude who came on and gave us a one-star review. I would love to tell you that that's implausible, but a teenager making fun of me is probably the most familiar experience of my life. Moving on! How about this? Tell me this How did what's his name get bit? Aussie. Oh, is that skin? Skin. Fur. 
whatever you want to call it, really. Okay, it looks human. Is that a tattoo? I don't think so. Or maybe I don't remember how he got bit. Bad one. Wait. Is it? Apparently, this belongs to whatever. Oh yeah, they kissed. Okay, I remember that. They're not allowed to kiss. Okay, do we have? This is Ace. The thing? Did they capture this it? is an Ace friendly stream. In the uh, in its weird flesh, so to speak. You want to touch the flesh? I want to touch the flesh. Well, fortunately, the person who sent this to me was smart enough to. Oh my God! Why are they talking about 2K Madrid? This did not evidence. take not place in Spain. We can move past that this part. You, Anton, would hide it away so as to sabotage this legitimate investigation. QA Central. I don't even know what that is. Convenient that we can't see the real deal, huh? Come on, man. You're desperate not to believe. If there's reasonable doubt, you have to assume it's not real. Occam's razor. But look at everything we've seen. Put it all together, objectively. So those kids, the ones who survived. Yeah. Who Why survived? Are they coming out with all this? Kids are always on the internet. Th these kids actually have something interesting to say. Why aren't they telling anyone? I don't know. But someone did come out with it. Whoever gathered all this info and submitted it to me right do we know who this is this could just be a teenager making fun of you no a teenager couldn't possibly do this i think you're being cyberbullied this is carefully curated information someone went into the depths of a dark mystery and retrieved all this information and gave it to this me this girl needs someone a real job smart, someone clever someone genius and it's all been hushed and if what we're looking at has any truth to it and I'm not surprised. Basically, we just need bodies, bodies, bodies to be turned into so a game like this. Kids who survived this, they're just out there living their lives? I mean, that's, that seems weird to me. I wonder what it took to keep them I would buy that in a really second. Happens, they'll be carrying it like a curse wherever they go. So you really still don't know who sent this to you? Nope. Complete anonymity. But the photos, the way they're all set out, it looks like evidence. Like they came from somewhere, I don't know, official. Okay, turn it off. What? Why? Why didn't you tell me about this before? What? Uh, I've been telling you about this it. This is actual stuff, Grace. We have to take this to the police. Okay. Oh, now they're gonna go to so, the police. Then you believe I don't it. know. Maybe. You never believe anything. Why is this any different? Because it's starting to make sense, okay? Our name on that letter, the missing hikers, the family secrets. I, when you put it all together, it's certainly something. Someone's trying to tell us something? And we should probably stop recording this right now and tell the authorities, right? Heck no, it's just getting juicy. And who says we're not the authorities? This is just uh, like... I do. We're not the authorities. Show. What? It's not like we have a moral duty Only to murders in the building. Authorities. We, we do. Selena Gomez should be in the next one. <gasps> podcast ended finally oh if Selena Gomez ever died in my gameplay I would restart the whole thing all right can we skip it e guess not Okay, <gasps> that has to be the bottom. Finally, epilogue. Is this epilogue? Death free one. I can barely read that. Whoever designed that designed this terribly. All I could see is you've unlocked blank feature allows you three blank through of the query to blank death and try again to blank wisely enable i guess okay bizarre yeah, I'm not listening to their podcast. Couch co-op. Wolf bath. Movie mode. 
Wait. Whoa. Oh, that's kind of cheating. Why not just play the game? Why would you just want to watch it? Especially if you do... Especially if you do director's chair. Like, just play. Chapter select. <gasps> no way! No way I play for 21 hours? No, that's not true. That's not true. That's not true. Or is it 21 hours from when I first started the game? That would make more sense. Right? Yeah, I started yesterday. Yeah. Dang, two people survived. <laughs> That's too good. Okay, new game. We're gonna hear Ariana. <laughs> Oh, this was an insane intro. <laughs> the sun is the setting in your eyes, yeah, by my side. side. And the movie is playing, but we won't be watching tonight. Yeah, but wait, can I skip the chapter? Or, I don't understand, I don't know. Do I not have to play the whole thing again? I wish they had like New Game Plus or something, so then like when I have to go collect all the like evidence and stuff, I wouldn't have to collect it again. Winter, that's for you, Andrea. Even though this character is supposed to look like her, I have no idea who she is. I mean, I guess because I don't watch Modern Family or whatever, I have no idea who she is. Oh, she said, turn that off. I think you know why. Um, I think you know why. I think I do. Begins with an L. Lesbians. Like Lesbians? Lost, Max. We're lost. We're just, we're in geographic flux. Right, so, lost. That's debatable. Oh! That's oh. Boom! Yeah, oh, honey, I caught it this can't. time! Yeah. Thank you. Man, the roads are definitely getting worse out here. I guess it's all part of the rustic summer camp experience. Oh, right, that's where we're going. I lost track like 200 miles ago. 200 miles ago, huh? Yeah. You know what, Max, it's okay. It doesn't make you any less of a man. You know, if Columbus hadn't gone lost and landed on these golden shores, there would be no United States of America. All right. Goodbye, hot dogs. See you later, <laughs> apple pie. Columbus never actually landed in North America. What are you talking about? Didn't even know he wasn't in Asia. Are you serious? Just another guy who didn't want to admit he was lost. Well, just another guy who's got a whole day named after him, so put that in your pipe and smoke it. Oh my god. Okay, just get us to camp already before I roll my eyes out of my head, please. <laughs> I'm working on it. I'm working on it. <sighs> Whoa. 
What is a leaflet? Well, I didn't pick it last time. Were there so. any directions on the flyer? No. Oh, a just pamphlet. A fake bunch of kids faking it around a fake okay. fire pit. Checks out. Everything okay? Yeah, all good. Excuse me, sir, you're driving? You're driving? Hey, eyes on the road, mister. Yeah. This man trying to kill us. Oh. Swerve. I know I just played this game yesterday, <laughs> but I can be jump scared by every single thing again. Are you okay? Yeah, yeah. No I, doubt. I mean, still in one piece. Jesus Christ, what do you think that was? A bear? What? No, no, Max, it wasn't a bear. What was it? I think it was a person. Lord, are you serious? Do you think we had a person? It was a werewolf. I don't know. I mean, it was really cl close, like really Why close. Why are they werewolves? They don't even look like werewolves. That does not look like Jacob from Twilight. What is it? I really have this car out. Well, maybe it looks worse than it is. Uh, I should check out the damage before we try to start it up again, huh? Could you grab my, uh, the, the toolbox? There's werewolves in Harry yeah. Potter. Why? Whee! It's not so bad. My mom's gonna kill me. All right, then. Hopefully I can collect all the tarot cards this time. I wonder how many I... We're snooping. I wonder how many... I got last time. Wait. Yeah, okay, they don't keep it. Oh, wow. All right. Okay. Why didn't you tell me? Thanks, Hans. Yeah. Do you need a hand? Yeah, actually, if you could just shine a light right here. There you go. Perfect, thank you. The sooner we get out of here, the better. Just picture yourself curling up in front of a big old fire pit singing campfire sing-alongs. I don't think people curl up right in front of big old fire pits. Why not? Uh, they don't want to catch on fire. And then, picture yourself curling up in front of a big old space eater. I want to go camp here. here. That sounds so fun. Hag, come on out. Where are you going? Just over here. Just. Just. Stay there for a second, okay? I'm almost done. Are you my boss? I'll listen. God, Max, hurry up! What's going on? I'm worried that there's somebody down there. Are you serious? Yeah, they could be hurt. I don't know. I didn't think we actually hit anyone. Well, I don't know. I just, I heard something, okay? Like a, a woman. Do you think we hit her? 
I just want to check it out. Okay. All right. Just don't go too far, okay? Be yeah. careful. Yeah. Uh oh, I'm picking my scab. Okay. Oopsies. Luck with the car. I shouldn't. But I want to. Let's get this tarot card. Yeah. Yeah. This is what I want to see. I don't even know how I missed tarot cards last time. Or like anything. I feel like I explored everything. How did I miss anything? Let's take a look. <laughs> yeah, I do take my sweet time walking around. I'm trying to tear apart every corner of this map. Maybe once I beat this game again, then I'll try Resident Evil again. That game seriously made me mad. Like, don't ask me to conserve bullets. I want to shoot that zombie dead. <gasps> Miss girl. <laughs> Miss girl. Why she walk like that? Hey. Hey. <laughs> Smile for the camera. Ooh, this girl gonna get me. I can't believe she's actually called a hag. Like, we gave her that name before we even knew. Oh, I saw her. Yeah. It's okay, it's the woods. There's a lot of stuff out there. There's animals, it's easy to freak yourself out. No. Can we just leave? Please? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go. Okay. 
Hmm? Yes, there we go. Burn like a kid. Max, come on! Here we go, here we go. We're getting out of here. Are you kidding me? Max! I just... Okay, give me a minute. Give me a minute. We've got to go, Max! Why are you not helping right now? Can you just... I am trying to get us out of here. All right, enough! Shit, I'm sorry, honey. I'm sorry. Sydney, Sweeney, Nia, chill out. It's okay. We're okay. We're safe in the car, really. We're gonna be okay. Jesus! Oh, oh, fuck. Oh, my God. My heart oh, ooh, jump scare. Roll it down. Hi, officer. How are you doing this evening? Are either of you injured? Really, we're fine. We're just a little shaken up. Mm-hmm. Well, you folks want to tell me what happened here? Yeah. Um. We swerved off. Uh. Well, we were just driving, and it's really, really dark out here, and, um, I don't know, we, we must have had, like, a, a pothole or something, because we swerved, and now here we are. I mean, I mean, these roads are really not in great shape. Yeah. Why is she the one talking when he's the one driving? Sir? Cop doesn't believe you. Oh, um, that is what happened, though. Sir? Is this kind of like the this wasn't the complete no, truth? Was first cop. What, like I wasn't ever? lying. Uh, yeah, I'm not a criminal. You folks want to tell me just what in the hell you are doing all the way out here this late at night? Dang, we're not allowed to roam. We're heading up to Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. We're new counselors. You're one night early. No, no, what? we know. Why did it take um, me like so long to put together that they were the now? lost counselors? They know we're coming. We called ahead. And to be honest, sir, one of us kind of oversold their navigation skills and got us completely lost. He's so scary looking. You're not going to make it to Haggett's quarry. Not tonight. Harbinger Motel. It's the nearest place you can bunk up there for the night, okay? Uh... I think we're just gonna stick to the plan, sir. I mean, Mr. Hackett knows we're coming and we called ahead. No, ma'am, you're gonna head to the Harbinger Motel. Do you understand? Okay. Okay, fine. Yeah, we'll head to the motel. Understood. Uh, there's just one small problem. Uh, I forgot to spring for the middle of nowhere coverage plan on my phone. What he means is we're lost completely. I know, right? All right like, now. step out of the vehicle. Oh, what? I just want to show you how to get to the motel on your map. There. Okay. For sure. Son, remain in the vehicle. It's okay. It's okay. Okay. Spices from that place in the Spider-Man game. Wow. Okay. Wow. So we are right about here. Harbinger Motel is here. Right. Okay. And where was Hackett's Quarry again? Well, I'm sure the fine folks. The Harbinger Motel can guide you there first thing in the morning. Right.
Blah, blah. Harbinger Motel. Stay on the road. Watch out. Wow, this conversation was so much shorter this time. I guess because I'm being compliant. Gonna get it done in two hours. Thanks for all your help. Thanks for all your help, though. Yeah. <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? You were shaking like a broken washing machine. I could have used a little backup. I mean, he clearly liked you better. Well, I'm very likable. That thing causes oh, much drama as well. Yes. I think I've had enough woodland encounters for one night. Thank you very much. Agreed. So where's this motel? Okay, so we're here. Mm -hmm. And the motel is here. Okay. But we're going here. What's there? Hackett's quarry. How'd you do that? I don't know. Kind of trick me. <laughs> very slick. Are you sure we should just get to the motel? Just listen to this guy's advice. Honey, you really want to listen to the advice of some creep-ass cop who told us in the middle of the creep-ass woods to go to some creep-ass hotel? No, that sounds terrible. Yeah. Let's hit the road, shall we? That's what I thought. Ma'am. Oh my god! <coughs> if he called me ma'am one more time, I was gonna shove that badge up his dick. <laughs> Seriously, do I look like a ma'am to you? I got like 20 years before I'm a ma'am. Mm-hmm. What? I... 20s... Debatable. Easy. I mean, I'm kind of into ma'ams. Okay, we're done. <laughs> I'm kind of into ma'ams. I get him. You gotta be kidding me. There's nobody here. We drive all the way the fuck out Max, here. Max, can we just look around before we jump to conclusions? Did you actually even talk to Mr. Hackett or did you just leave a message? Well, what's the difference? This. This is the difference. Hello? I guess he doesn't check his voicemail. How was I supposed to know that? He in the basement. I mean, clearly there's somebody here. Yeah, or it's just an abandoned car and this is a complete waste Why of time. Why would there be an abandoned... I'll beat the car. Max, come on. Max, don't be a dick. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What's going on? Is anybody home? There needs to be like a brisk walk button in this game. Cause they just be strolling. Yeah, I think a sprint would be asking too much. Okay, why is there like nothing in here? Also, when they showed me this camera angle for the first time yesterday, <laughs> it freaked me out. I thought something was going to run across. But no. Nada importante. Okay. Yeah, like, why would they give me that camera angle? There's nothing there. Let's go see what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Fun. 
doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Noise. Lord, there's no one here. Come on. Just give me one more minute, okay? Don't rush me. I think personally, I wouldn't go into the basement of this person's house. Hey, hey you ready to roll? That's just me, though. Like, how do you see that thing and then think, oh, right let, let me call out to it? That looks like Gollum. Max! Max, get over here! What's going on? There's somebody in the bunker. I think they might be stuck. Stuck? Is it Mr. Hackett? I, I don't know. Just bring some tools so we can break the lock. Hey, I'm back. We're gonna get you out of there. Hey, hey. Wait, wh what are these? I don't know, you just said tools. Why didn't you just bring them? That's because these white people. There's someone in there. Uh, I'm not seeing anyone. What? No, look. I'm looking, I'm looking, I am. Let me see. We see them. There, there was definitely someone there. <laughs> okay, okay, so... Okay, I'll do the wrench this time. No hammer time. You sure? Yes, I want the wrench. Wait, yes. Saw it online. Yeah, saw it online. Ooh, okay. Damn. You need a hand? Yeah. You've seen Evil Dead, right? I haven't seen Evil Dead. Hello? Are you hurt? Do you exist? Hey, be careful. Why are you as a man taking a seat? You should be investigating. You even a real man? I'm just... You know, I'm scoping it out. Sissy. Ian, who's Ian? I don't remember there being an Ian. Oh! Max? That's nasty.
Hun, maybe it was a possum or something. No, there was there was someone here, I swear. Hey. It's been kind of a night, you know? Let's just get to the motel. We can come back here first thing in the morning, we can check everything out, but I mean you must be exhausted. I know I am. I think our imagination. <laughs> I just leave him. Oh, I mean, I guess either way. I think I'm Wait. being alive. No, I think you would die. Okay, let me help him. Actually, no, I guess he could still live because the cop. I don't know. Imagine he just dies this early in the game. My friend. Hey, Aggie. We are friends, aren't we? I've waited for you. I've waited. Yes. So I do hope our time together proves enlightening. There's no need to worry. I'm here to help you. Think of me as your guide into the unknown. It's exciting. Into the unknown. But if you're brave enough, if you let me help you, I can help you. We can help each other. This is the card you found. See? The fool. I wonder who this is. We all know a fool when we see one, don't we? Innocence and freedom. All recklessness and risk-taking. Spontaneity. Actions without thought, but the consequences to match. Think. Think, and don't get burnt. I can show you more if you'd like me to. Yeah. This is what might come to pass. A possible future. 
a path yet unchosen. I still don't know which one I'm supposed to pick. Secrets and lies. Paths to uncover on which I can shed light. If you let me. Help me help you. And remember, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Doesn't kill you, makes you stronger. Stand a little taller. Doesn't mean I'm lonely when I'm alone. Oh, I love the YouTube music. Should be Addison Ray. You know how many hearts are broken on the last day of summer camp? It's like a romance apocalypse. You never know. Hmm. I mean, you never know. The universe has a kind of way of uh, working these things out. The universe? Yeah, like the uh, the cosmic. See you, girl. Gods. Talking about astrology. Gods. Okay, spell it. Nothing to spell, you know, we're cool. Oh, so cool. We are super cool. So she dumped her ass, huh? <laughs> okay, quit. Hi, Emma. Hey. <laughs> okay, this is, um... You've heard of spatial awareness before, yeah. right? Spatial awareness is for nerds. Uh, be a lamb and grab the last couple of bags, will ya? Yes, boss. Say hi to Emma for me. You're a bad person. Yes, I am. Oh, my turn. We tearing this camp apart again. What doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Not in the mood, sign. Emma's gonna kill him. Wait, let me see. Um, think and don't get burnt. Okay, so what I did last time was correct. I wonder what's killing the deer. Okay. Jake, bags, focus. Whatever you say, Mama. Oh, hey, this is Emma's. Why did I just pick up a watch?
What? Okay. Hey, Pookie. <clears throat> hey, what are you, uh, what are you listening to? <laughs> Good to know. All right, nothing to see there, I guess. Yeah, like we can climb these stairs a bit faster. We got places to be. Jesus Christ. Hey, hey, are you guys gonna help with the bags or what? Oh, um, you know, I was actually just working on fixing uh, the door. It's Dylan, come it's on. Broken. Dylan, please. I can't. It's, it's... I gotta get the last bags What's in there. Come wrong on. With this thing? It's just... Dylan, please. Sorry, bro. Cool, thanks guys. He acts like a girl. You want to be a girl so bad. So pretty. Man. Who'd want to leave a place like this? It's like a goddamn Bob Ross. Ugh, horror. I hate horror. Nothing back here. Right then. Take a selfie with the bear. Selfie. You need Emma. I'm not going off it yet. And this is where Brenda Song died. <gasps> I didn't get that card before.
I didn't go in the freezer either. Man, that's a bad place to get stuck. Oh, okay. So they probably freeze to death if you go in there anyway. already. I didn't even get to talk to that man. All right. Oh, well. Got the bags. Great. All by yourself, huh? Yep. Guess you're gonna have to get used to that. Oh my god. You are so Ooh. mean. <laughs> At least I'm honest. Oh. Him. Okay, here we go. Okay, you're not telling me the whole truth about you and Emma, are you, son? Oh, okay, so now I'm the one who's not telling the whole story, huh? <laughs> oh, well, this is the bait I just gotta take, Jake. <laughs> oh. oh, sorry, I just got so distracted about that rhyme, I forgot what we oh, were... Oh, no, 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 uh, you, you were telling me how you totally have a thing for Ryan. Wait, are we talking about Ryan, the sailing instructor with the sexy brooding loner thing that totally doesn't do anything for me at all? I knew it. <laughs> knew it. <laughs> Who said I was hiding that? I'm not. I'm just saying, you know, I feel like if you really did like the guy, you would have made a move by now. <laughs> so she really just dumped her ass, huh? I don't... Okay. Her whole thing. Is like, how are we gonna make this work? Different schools, blah, blah, blah. My whole thing is like, you know, maybe long distance, blah, 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 blah. And she was just like, Jacob. She gave you the look, huh? Yeah, do not pass go. Man, she has got you wrapped all the way around that dainty little finger of hers. How does she do it? <laughs> maybe I like it. <laughs> okay, okay, you know what? Maybe you're right. Maybe she does have like this superpower over me, but you know what? Maybe I like it. <laughs> oh, likes it. Check. Totally not in denial. Oh, Check. Okay. Wow, the um the fumes of, of jealousy are just stifling over I here. Could be a good himbo if he didn't look like that. And he wasn't so annoying. Big dog. You're a real charmer, you know that? Seize the moment. I'm just saying, I don't know why you didn't make a move on Ryan. You should have seized the moment. <sighs> well, can't seize the moment that never happened. Yeah, well, you can't wait for it to come to you. You got to make the moment happen yourself. Oh, right. Chase the moment around all summer like a dog with two dicks until it dumps you on the last day of camp. Okay. Not going to miss you, Caitlin. <laughs> okay, so are we sure that this old rust bucket's roadworthy? <laughs> we'll take a look. It better be. One more night in the great outdoors might actually kill me. Hey, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Well, I haven't killed you yet. And you're still pretty pathetic. Hey, shut up. <clears throat> uh, okay, so, um, total hypothetical, but if I was like a huge asshole and I wanted to break down the van so we'd have to spend another night here, uh, what exactly would I need to do? Well, you'd... Probably break the fuel line, or, I don't know, rip out the rotor arm. And yes, that would make you a total asshole. Okay, and what does a rotor arm look like again? It's like an arm that's all rotary. You know, it's under the little black dome with the leads poking out. Jake, you do realize that even if we somehow did get stuck out here, one more night with Emma wouldn't make a difference. Trust me, chick's made up her mind. Yeah. Sure. I guess we'll just have to find out. 
Yeah, breaking a fuel line just seems like such a dumb idea. Gas would be everywhere. Gas me up. You come on with me, buddy. I'll put you right back tomorrow. No harm, no foul. Up here, my dudes. Why do they look like they're up to something? Hey, Jacob. What? No, dude, please. D d d d long. Oh, Nick. Boom. Oh. oh, there it is. Oh, Ooh, man, good sight. Freak. Oh. oh. Ooh, I wish I had some singles. Oh, freaks. Mm. Surrounded by freaks. <laughs> oh, thank God. I'm gonna get the whole no technology thing, but take me back, world. You would have thought Mr. H could have, like, charged up our phones, like, a little bit. Nothing's ever your fault, is it? <laughs> you know, you should really just save it for emergencies only. <laughs> Unless, of course, is being dumped an emergency. Dang. <laughs> They're just dogging on him. Uh, okay, well, at least I had a relationship this summer. Ooh, damn, now we burn. Yeah, well, maybe not everyone is looking for a hook. Okay, 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 let's all put our little dicks away and get this show on the road, huh? Where's everybody else? Why, why would I know that? Mm -hmm. Sometimes you know stuff I don't. Look, I don't, I don't even know how to respond to that. You say, Nick, you're way smarter than me, and you're a super hot stud who gets any cheeky ones. Okay, yeah, keep German, Junior. <gasps> Andrea, your favorite. I'm saying I'm kind of obsessed with how like useless she is. Like she low-key died and nobody even moved. <laughs> like her head was fully on the floor. Hey there, party bear. Status report? We are officially empty nesters. High five up top. High five. Oh boy. You're about to get your phone back, aren't you? Let's go collect our bags and away from this mosquito-infested backwoods dump. Doors locked, bags inside. <sighs> Fuck me. Yep. Well, it's obvious what we have to do here. Find someone with a key? Shape our destiny. And by shape our destiny, I mean shape our way through this crappy lock and grab our bags. Why would we just leave our bags there? Okay, let's do it. We better not get in trouble. I won't tell if you won't tell. Mr. Hackett's gonna find out. So what? He'll just think it was a bear or something. Have you ever seen a bear in these woods? No, but there's Have you ever seen a bear in these woods? Shut up. Fair point. All right, let's Fair do this. Fair Joey King. On three. One. Two. Three! Ugh. All about the power of positive thinking. Why do I ever listen to you? Because I'm always right. Are you sure they're gonna think it was a bear? Oh my god, relax. It's not like we killed someone. All right, well, I'm just gonna take another look around, make sure we didn't miss anything. Go nuts. Oh. Aw. This was little Izzy's. Um, last time that bunny didn't help me with anything, so I'm leaving it. Yeah, you can probably just stay here, you creepy little thing. Maybe that bunny can save Dylan's arm. Why would this place be in the news?
can't believe I'm actually gonna miss all those lumpy loose springs. Time to go. Let's go see our little ghost friend over here. It's gonna be weird not waking up to Dylan's morning announcement. What's that all about? Is that to indicate the hag with her crow? I don't know. What is that thing that was in the tree that smells bad? Yeah, I'm about to go up and down the steps of every single one of these buildings, by the way. I'm not missing anything. <gasps> is not going to be happy that the kids just like this now. <laughs> I'll tell Chris about it when we see him. That was loud. Her backpack has wings on it. Nada. Now, let's take a look at this swing. Whee! Okay. Ouch. <laughs> Jacob hasn't seen this. Jacob and Emma for summer. <laughs> In this thing. Down to me. Ugh. Ugh. What is that? Is it Dylan's? Ugh. I'll go to those cabins next. I don't think there's anything up there. No.
don't think anyone knocked Caitlin out of first place all summer. Someone knocked her into the pool. Yeah. Okay. Nothing. All right. Let's see how I missed anything yet. Yep. <laughs> wow. Hey, Emma. Ready to roll? Let's do it. Finally. Time to let loose and vamoose this caboose. How are you so dramatic? Annoying. Confident. It's just acting. Oh, bet. It's what the people want. So They're gonna baking? be. I mean, in a way, faking it is. Actually, just wait. Do I have to make them friends so then she the won't kiss the other guy to make the other one jealous, and then they she won't go off and kiss so then he won't get bit? No. <laughs> it's too late now, anyway. For what? You and Nick? You never know unless you put yourself out there. Skr skr. Jinkies. You're okay, not so Velma. Hypothetically, if I were to put myself out there, what if he ends up being a dud, kind of like you and Jacob? He's actually really sweet. Then why'd you put it? Summer fling. We're going to school like four states away. I, he gets it. Yeah, sure. But that's us. You and Nick could be different. When you get his handle, hit him up. Oh, I already have his email. It was in the packet they gave to us on the first day. I already have his email. Email? Are you 93? What's wrong with email? Girl, it's 2022. Oh, hold on. Oh, but the lodge is that way. Go right here. Why? Come on, scenic route? One last victory lap around the camp. Okay. Yes. Sure. What's the victory? Two months. No technology. I kind of thought it was nice to be offline. Ugh, I didn't. Plus, my subs need me. How could they live without you? 
Oh, how'd they even get by for two months without you? I will have you know that I have a very loyal and engaged subscriber base. I provide very important and educational lifestyle advice in the form of entertaining and hilarious video monologues. They rely on me. Oh, totally. You're a big deal. Uh, yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm sure they're gonna be, like, really happy you're back. <laughs> My favorite spot? The fire pit? The island. Mad secluded, right? Mad secluded. Is is that smoke? Should we tell someone? Mm, it looks pretty contained. It's probably just Mr. H burning some stuff before, you know, he closes camp for the summer. Yeah. Speaking of which, we should we should probably, you know, get back. Oh yeah, worried next. God, she's um, such a good two shoes. Well, no, they're probably like all waiting for us. Mm-hmm. Everyone's waiting for us. Everyone, yeah. Nick, waiting for you. So oh, annoying. God, I want her to die again. But I'm supposed to keep everyone alive. Don't worry, Jacob, I got you. I got a full tank of gas, so. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> oh, idiot. <laughs> Does nobody own phone chargers anymore? Hey, there's no signal out here anyways, dude, okay? This place is like patchy as balls. <sighs> Your balls are patchy? What? No. It's okay, I'll just go get some juice from Mr. H before we go. Uh, ew. <sighs> Hey, Nick. Hey, where were you guys? <gasps> Wouldn't you like to know? Ignore her, please. Let's go. Just gotta get these bags up onto the... Oh, hey, hey, here. Let me, um, let me get it for you. I can take care of my own bag, thank you. What? Are you sure? Because, I mean, it's really not that big she of a deal. She can take care of her own bag, thank you. We can I'll make that girl put her own bag in. Own bag. Thank you. Cool. Ugh. Yeah, put your own bag in there. Done, boys. Hey, has anyone seen Ryan? Oh yeah, he's probably off being all brooding and mysterious and alluring somewhere. <laughs> I'm here. What were you doing under there? Having a little me party? Uh, I was listening to a podcast, actually. Oh, podcast. Nice. That's cool. What's it about? Yeah, what's it about? Is it about me? You think I was listening to a podcast about you? Okay, if anyone here had a podcast about them, it'd be me. Yeah, if there was a podcast called How to Look and Smell Like a Butt. Oh my god, you are so childish. At least I don't look and smell like a butt. No, it's a, it's a paranormal podcast. This episode was actually about this place, weirdly enough. The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. The who of the what's it where now? Hag. What's the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? You don't know about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Uh, if I did, would I be asking them ass? Tell her about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. I don't think she wants to know about the Hag of Hackett's <laughs> oh, Quarry. Can we just please stop saying the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? It's just this campfire story for the kids. It's, um, they're supposedly an old woman who died in a fire a few years back. She haunts the woods looking for her lost baby boy. There are like reports of whispers or whatever and, and this 
figure that floats around, you know, textbook ghost stuff. Some people say that if she catches you alone, she'll try to turn you into her son. So or not the plot of Barbarian. Something. I don't know. It's never really been clear. Anyways, Haga Haga it's Corey. Give me that up. It's right here in the podcast, man. Cool story, bro. <laughs> Seriously, though, you should have seen the first time you told the story to the kids at the campfire. They were scarred for life. I mean, not for life. <laughs> you gotta be careful with this stuff, man. This shit's true. Come on, dude, bullshit. What's the holdup, Hacketeers? Yeah, uh, uh, nearly done, Mr. H. Well, hop to it. Get those butts in gear. Sorry, Mr. H. Yeah, to liberate some luggage. Shut up. Maybe if somebody didn't spend so much time trying to press the ladies' ball as ghost stories. You asked. Ghost stories? The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Oh! <sighs> hey, you still have the van key, Mr. H? Well, yes, I do. But you know, I'm grown up boy scout. My head if it wasn't stuck on. Back to the office I go. Give me a hand, would you, Ryan? Oh, okay. Yo, Mr. H. What's up, DJ Dillon? Any chance I could get a little charge? I want to have some uh, tunes for the road. No can do. How stupid. Cool, cool, yeah. No worries. Good man. Uh, no big deal. You can share my earbuds. The way they're flirting went from like a hundred to zero the second his arm got cut off. Like, what's up with that? So, uh, Chris, I I'm actually glad we got a moment to talk. Uh, uh-oh. I'm not fired, am I? <laughs> no, no, it's, um, it's just, you know, about the whole thing w with the... Hold that thought, partner. I'm gonna have to take this. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, uh, sorry. Hello. Yeah. I'll listen to my stupid podcasts. Sorry about that, bud. Sorry about that, bud. Didn't mean to push you out like that. You, uh, you need a hand looking for the keys? Uh, no, end of summer, busy, busy, you know. Anyway, you were asking me? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, it was just the whole animation school thing, what you thought I should do. Right. Y you know, whether or not I should, like, leave my sister with my grandparents, since I'd have to live on campus, you know. My mom's not exactly around, so I wouldn't want to leave Sarah on her own. You know, fam our family's small enough as it is. Well, family is important, right? Dang it. Okay. You got a hot day tonight? Oh boy. If you only knew. <laughs> so, uh, what, what did you need me for? You're one of my favorite counselors, Ryan. You know that. One of the good ones. But 
Do you know how many calls I get from parents, letter after letter, with these terrified kids that they send home? Huh. I, I didn't realize that. Believe it or not, scaring kids away from sleepaway camp is kind of bad for business. So maybe just ease up on the ghost stories?
from side.
Yeah, it was just a fun story that weirdo kid told me last month. Hey, there's no weirdo here. At Hackett's Quarry, everyone's their own brand of cool. You cancelers gotta be the responsible ones. Keep the kids happy. Keep the kids safe. So knock it off. Yeah, of course. I mean, we are. Seriously, Chris, what's going on? I just want to get you guys safely out of Dodge before the sun goes down.
Oh, 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 oh. Totally, yeah. Best to get you all out of harm's way. Woods are chock full of live game and local hunters hop to it the second camp's over. It's not safe. Hmm. Good goddamn, are they? Will you say goodbye to Caleb and Kaylee for me? He sort of just snuck off. Well, you'll see him again next year. Caleb works at the scrap yard during the off season, and Kaylee, well, she's still figuring out what she wants to do. She's got her whole life ahead of her. They both just come and go as they please, really. Teenagers, am I right? Actually, could have used the help packing up since we were short staffed. Hey, you guys seem to manage all right. But I'll tell them both you were sad you missed them. Unlocked the van, put the keys in my pocket, came in the office. Right where I left them. Uh -huh. Let's get out of.